What's going on guys, Vegas here, and today I just got finished watching the Dallas Cowboys beat the Philadelphia Eagles 33-13 to in a pretty big smackdown that the Cowboys laid on the Eagles this game. Now, for me personally, uh, I don't I don't think the Eagles are going to look this bad uh, in in the playoffs when they get there. Um, I, per I think that the Eagles were just tired because they were just coming off a tough game after tough game after tough game. And eventually, uh, one of these games, or both games against the 49ers and the Cowboys, that the Eagles were just going to look flat. So I'm not going to write off the Eagles uh, as not potential Super Bowl contenders uh, when they get into the playoffs. But it does raise, raise questions on if the Eagles can be more consistent on the offensive or defensive side of the ball. Because that's kind of the struggle that this Eagles team has been having this entire season is that they haven't been consistent or not consistent, but I guess dominant in these games that they were last year. And so that was, that was the main question uh, going into this game or going to the season, I would say, is, is if the Eagles will have still have dominant presence when they go against these uh, good teams. And they haven't really shown that uh, in the season, but... I think that they'll get back on the right track when it when they get into the playoffs, and they won't be this bad uh, if they do potentially face the uh, Cowboys again. Now, for the Cowboys, it's kind of different in judging if the uh, if that team is actually legit or not, because again, the Cowboys they beat on bad teams. Um, Prescott is playing at an MVP level. Um, but I will say if the Cowboys can't get the number one seed and they're able to play at home, then I will say that the Cowboys have a chance to actually win a Super Bowl because that's probably the thing that's holding them back. And I don't know why, but I guess when they play at home, this Cowboys team just plays a whole lot better. So if they're able to take the 49ers to play at their stadium, then they might have a chance. And... As long as Dak Prescott keeps playing the way he's playing, then that again they'll they'll have a chance. And so we've been in this position before, uh, this year and last year. And when it comes to Dak Prescott being able to compete in these games and him not be able to fall flat when it comes to face, facing the 49ers, that that'll be the main question when they get into the playoffs. But I personally think that this Cowboys team is really good. And that they have a chance to basically win it all. But the first step for them to win it all is getting that number one seed. Because if they go back to the uh, San Francisco, then I think they're just going to lose. And it's going to be another 49ers Super Bowl uh, this year. So that's kind of my thought of the whole situation of this game. Uh, I, I kind of just think the Eagles were just tired and fatigued. Uh, coming off a tough game after tough game. But... It's really good for the Cowboys to get this win and for them to basically keep this momentum that they've been going for the rest of the season and when they get into the playoffs. And if that Prescott play, keeps playing the way he's playing, keeps playing the way he's playing, then not only do I think he's going to win MVP, then I think that his team will get into the Super Bowl. So that's kind of it, guys, for this video. Let me know in the thought in the comments below what you guys think. Uh, do you think that this Eagles team is actually overrated? Do you think this Cowboys team is legit and that they'll actually get to the Super Bowl? So let me know in the comments below and I will catch y'all later. Peace.